Kenya is currently experiencing the worst drought in the last 40 years. And according to the Kenya Wildlife Service that is in charge of the country's flora and fauna, the wildlife and environment too has been affected largely. I am in Amboseli National Park, located at the border of Kenya and Tanzania, near the world-famous Mount Kilimanjaro, the highest mountain in Africa. This is one of the worst heat ecosystems by the drought. The Amboseli National Park is a world-famous tourist attraction in Kenya, where a large number of wild animals live, which are being affected by the drought. It has affected the numbers of wildlife, as you've seen quite a number of animals have died. Not only human beings have been affected, I must say that wildlife have most hit uh, by this drought pandemic. Currently, as by our last national census on animals that have been affected by the drought, uh, more than a thousand number of uh, animals have been affected, especially the Afipos. Koski added that part of the most significant impacts of climate change on the park is the melting of ice from Mount Kilimanjaro affecting the swamp habitat in the area. Amboseli is a very important ecosystem and the, the most affected areas is uh, the, the swamps. We've seen the swamps enlarging. We've seen also a small lake emerging within, within the park which has never been there before. That shows it's too much melting of ice from Kilimanjaro. Kenya Wildlife Service, through the Kenyan government, has taken measures to mitigate the climate's effects on the wildlife in different parks. One of the issues that we have embarked on seriously on is uh, supplementary feeding. We are doing what you call uh, uh, A, feeding of animals. We've got designated around 12 feeding points for the, for the wildlife within the park. So we are doing this on a daily basis and we are consuming 500 bales every, uh, every week. Uh, we're also doing uh, water tracking. We supplement what, especially outside protected area, because most of the wildlife do move away from the park. They take too long time, or long distances, actually to to get in the park. So we supplement water. 